Hello everyone, so in this video I'm going to show you how you can get all skin IDs for the items from your Steam Workshop. So I'm going to use Rust as an example and here you can see all the items that are available in the workshop. So if I click on AK, as you can see it says 6376. That means these are all the IDs that are available for AK47. So I'm going to click it or you can do it with any workshop you want and any item you want. So as you can see all the list here. If you do it manually, you have to click each item one by one then copy the ID. So we are going automate this process so this is the script that we are going to use and it only run on Linux but you can find a way around to just use it on your Windows you can install uh, like WSL or you can create a virtual machine or buy a VPS or whatever you want but I'm going to use the back git bash uh, that you can easily install on your PC you can watch any video of it so this is the script I uh, just pasted it here and the name of the file should be .sh if you direct download it from uh, github then it should already be .sh as you can see here it's a .sh uh, now I'm gonna run it to run I'm gonna use git bash so uh, I will right click here open git bash here let me zoom in and here you have to type dot slash skin box if you press tab it's gonna auto complete it now you need the link of the workshop item you have to go back here and here you can see this is the link you have to copy it go back to your script and then you have to put in double quotes this is important you can paste it with shift insert now you have to type in the file name so it should be ak47 skins uh, you can change it whatever you like then how many pages you want to read so for example we have like 205 total pages if you want to get like all the ids then you have to type 205 if i want to get like some of them or half of them then you can get half so in this example i'm going to use like only two pages so i can type two that's it you have to press enter and it's going to create the file for us uh, now the process is completed you can go back to the script folder and here you can see the file ak47 skins so this is the list of skins that were available from page one to page two and now to test if these are real i'm going to copy one id and then click any of the item here then paste replace it and you can see this was the id that was copied here now you may be confused why there are like commas there uh, i was using it for like a skin box plugin if you want to remove it just press ctrl f then find with comma then replace it with all with empty should be removed so that's how you can get all these steam item ids from the workshop